New tonight, our defenders team uncovering shocking new details in the case of a Gaston County mom accused of leaving her three kids home alone drinking vodka. And during her first court appearance this week, the mother saying this is all just a misunderstanding. And for the first time tonight, we're hearing the 911 calls made from frantic neighbors. NBC Charlotte defender Mark Boyle has been digging into this case all day. Mark, what have you learned? The 26 year old mother of three faces a couple of charges, including child abuse. And according to these court documents right here, this is not the first time police have been called to the apartment here behind me and new tonight. We're now hearing the 911 call that tipped off police. The 911 call was made just before 8 PM Monday. Hey, we'll have officer come hey. Concerned about these, child, these children's well being. An alarmed neighbor told police to rush to the Hartford Point apartments off of Hartford Drive in Gaston County. I have three, there are three young children here who have no adult supervision and they're running around the apartment complex pulling their clothes off naked. Police showed up and according to investigators, they found three kids, the oldest just seven years old, reportedly drunk from Grey Goose vodka and completely unsupervised. The arrest report also indicates one of the children was simulating sex acts on one of her brothers. Their mother, 26 year old Taisha Streeter, was arrested and told the judge this was all just a big misunderstanding. The alcohol that was there, I had this with Police say Streeter left the kids unsupervised for more than seven hours, and during that time, the 911 caller said the kids were making allegations about their family. The child is making statements like her daddy gave her beer, that they sometimes live in Charlotte, that they don't have a family. The Department of Health and Human Services would not provide much detail about its investigation, but NBC Charlotte did confirm police have responded to this address at least four times over the past two years. Some of those calls are for domestic reasons. Now, according to the Gaston County Court, Streeter has a clean criminal record until now, and now investigators are working to figure out what went wrong, and neighbors just hope the kids are taken care of. I did go to the jail this afternoon to speak with Streeter behind bars. She refused our request. Now reporting in Gaston County, I'm Mark Boyle, NBC Charlotte. My heart goes out to those children. Mark, thank you.